Alright YouTube, this is Chris. I'm driving my buddy Eric's GT4. This is a 2016 Cayman GT4. I'm filming this on my iPhone because I don't even have my film gear with me. This thing has full exhaust, Dundon headers, Dundon Motorsports tune, and it sounds amazing. As you can hear. <laughs> this car is just awesome. So my buddy is basically selling it to try and get a 991 3RS. But this car is really amazing. It has the carbon buckets, the PCCBs, all the fancy options you want um, in a GT4 especially. And with the headers exhaust, it's pretty amazing. Um, the sound is just ridiculous. So, I know I don't have my GoPro so I can't film that well, but we took a bunch of videos of it today on Eric's nice camera. He's gonna put a video on his channel. He's up there driving in my R8. There he goes, taking off. This thing is just a beast. I mean, the steering is actually really good. I, I didn't think it would be amazing just because I know Porsche is on uh, electric steering now. It's not hydraulic um, like it was in my 987. However, now it's, um, yeah, so now it's electric and um, I mean, the steering is just fantastic. Now we're at a red light, so I'll show you the interior, GT4, got the roll bar, wing risers in the back. Uh, all of these are stick shift. The only complaint, I guess, that some people say is the gearing is pretty long. I could see that. I think for back road cruising, it's pretty short. You're kind of stuck in second for a lot of the time. Um, but if you're on the track, um, in which case, uh, you know, Eric up there in the R8, he's taking this thing GT4 on the track a couple times and um, he said it wasn't really a big issue the uh, long gearing so um, it's worked out pretty well in his case so but I don't doubt that Porsche has made the gearing long in attempt to nerf it to make sure uh, people aren't just buying these over something like a GT3 RS or a GT3 um, and plus being that it's a uh, six speed that might have to do with some of the longer gear ratios as opposed to something like the PDK 7 speeds and um, some of the newer ones. Those They have uh, an extra gear to spread the ratio out over and make the gears a little bit shorter. So, um, yeah, I mean, sorry for the crude video, but this thing is just a beast. There we go, ready? Sport mode means auto rev matching too, so I just go like this, pull the clutch in and downshift and we're good to go. Another cool feature of the car. Anyway, um, yeah, I'll try and link the video to Eric's channel. Or I'll drop a link to Eric's video of this car when he's done making it. And you guys can see some of the footage we took of this thing just absolutely ripping. I mean, this thing is just ridiculous. I love the R8. I think it's an amazing all-around car, but this is definitely another level for um, that track feel. I mean, no doubt. Ridiculous. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe. Check out videos of my 